everyone, I'm Janeska Garcia, the IVP of Eureka, and I will be discussing the Sustainable Development Goal 15, one of the 17 SDGs established by the United Nations in 2015, entitled Chronicle of Terrestrial Life, Exploration of Life on Land. For our table of contents, we have Introduction, the Value of Healthy Ecosystems, Global Action for Sustainable Future, the Consequences of Losing Forests, the health impact of habitat loss, and lastly, conclusions and reflections. For our introduction, one of the 17 sustainable development goals is about conserving life on land. Life on land and underscores the critical need to protect and restore Earth's ecosystem. This encompasses sustainable forest management, combating desertification, halting land degradation, and preventing biodiversity loss all vital for safeguarding the well-being of our planet and ourselves. The value of healthy ecosystem. Earth's ecosystem are vital for sustaining human life. They contribute significantly to our well-being. Over half of the global GDP relies on these natural systems. Beyond our economics, they hold immense cultural, spiritual, and social value. However, we face a critical challenge, a triple crisis, one of climate change, pollution, and biodiversity loss, escalating deforestation, land degradation, and species extinction, which poses a severe threat to human health and the environment. Global Action for Sustainable Future Global and regional efforts to sustain forest ecosystem as well as their social, economic, and environment functions are essential, in particular for developing countries and the tropics. We need to shift humanity relationship with the nature to achieve conserving life on land and realize that nature is the root of our life on earth. The consequences of losing forests. Lost forests translate to lost livelihoods in rural communities, increased carbon emission, a decline in biodiversity, and further land degradation. One of the most irreversible impacts of human activity on the environment is species extinction, which upsets the balance of nature and makes ecosystems more fragile and less resistant to disruptions. A recent UN report on biodiversity found that around 1 million animal and plant species are now threatened with extinction, many within decades more than ever before in human history. The health impact of habitat loss. The destruction of natural habitats and exploitation of wildlife are driving the emergence of zoonotic diseases, diseases transmitted from animals to humans. These zoonotic diseases have a devastating impact on human health, and particularly in low- and middle-income countries. Millions of people die from these diseases annually. Additionally, zoonotic outbreaks can cause severe illnesses and economic losses in livestock populations for the impact food security and livelihoods. Increased demand for animal protein, a sustainable farming practices, and the climate crisis all contribute to this risk, as seen with the COVID-19. And we are on our last part, which is conclusions and reflections. Conserving life on land is not a luxury. It's a necessity. By taking action to protect and restore ecosystem, we safeguard our own future, ensuring a healthy planet for generations to come. Let's act now to ensure thriving life on land for all. Here is my reference for our topic, and that's all for our SDG 15. Thank you so much for watching. Bye!